from Minnesota's most watched station. This is WCCO 4 News. Well, good Saturday morning. I'm Mike Augustinek. And I'm Rachel Slavic in for Natalie Nias. The weather is cooling, so we're spending more on time inside. And you might be looking for some ideas on how to make your house more of a home. Well, the Parade of Homes, it's a great way to get some ideas and to connect with developers. Coming up in a few minutes, we'll bring you inside a couple of the homes on this fall's tour, which is going on right now. Well, looking for a way to get out of the house today? This could help, sort of. Yeah, actually, you're going to go from one home to another with more than 400 on tour during the Fall Parade of Homes. We're going to bring you inside a few of them coming up next. For 68 years, the Twin Cities has hosted a Parade of Homes to present new building and decor ideas to area families. At 400 a year in 68 years, that's a lot that's of a lot homes. homes. Uh, starting today, you can see them all across the extended metro. Here's a look inside. This project is a number of single family customizable homes. We have six spec homes. We're standing in the model right now. It is a 10 minute drive from downtown. It's so easy. And you walk right outside your door and you have parks and trails and um, green space and Shingle Creek. So it's pretty convenient and lifestyle here is amazing. Uh, no. Huge windows, people love that. Um, open floor plan, nine foot ceilings. A lot of great things here. Nice big open kitchen here. Right, and stainless steel appliances. I mean, just kind of the feel of this kitchen could make me want to cook even. <laughs> yeah, it's, and it, like you said, it's wide open to the rest of the house, so you don't feel cut off, and it's as right. much a living space as it is a functional space. Mm -hmm. Jessa, I love this feature. This is some home surround sound control, but it's actually on an iPad. Right, there's an iPad right in there. Um, it controls all the sound throughout the home and you can do it from uh, your smartphone as well. Is there any other place in Minneapolis where you can get a brand new neighborhood these days? Oh, no, nothing that even compares. So. I mean, we have, we're going to have 60 new homes here, which, I mean, blows anything similar out of the water. So what's wonderful about going from the uh, living room into the, uh, uh, through the living room is these wonderful big doors. Mm -hmm. Opens up into a uh, uh, covered porch area. Um, it really brings you into the neighborhood, but yet you have your privacy uh, back here. Sure. It's like neighbors uh, walking by, you feel like you're part of uh, the overall neighborhood. This is actually a fun, uh, fun project to look at the kitchen beam work coming over to the uh, fireplace mantle, looking at a cast stone uh, fireplace that we had custom built in uh, Oklahoma. There's a really good informal tied to the overall look and feel of this uh, entire room. The lighting's so regal too. It really is. We really tried to make a grand foyer entrance to this from the uh, camphered spindles, which are very traditional, to the wainscot paneling, um, very traditional carpet runner um, going up the stairs on uh, tre open treads risers. Um, a lot of hardwood floor in this house. That's very traditional in, in this area also. shopping <laughs> considering selling and buying a new a, home and we're opining about how we feel about those homes we're, I, we'll take the the cheaper one right yeah yeah and I do love how the focal point the garage is no longer the focal point I agree yeah. yeah that's a nice style well the fall parade of homes is going on today through October 2nd open Thursday through Sunday from noon until 6 all homes are free except for the four artis uh, artisan dream homes which are five dollars yeah and that money goes to uh, charity so that's great yeah